Welcome to Football Gossip. Yes, Here's where you get the daily news, match analysis, and latest updates about Manchester United. Now, if you need to channel, please do the subscribe, like this video, leave a comment below, and watch this video to the end. Today, we are talking about Manchester United bind and also Master Service of Permanent and even the latest Manchester United transfer news. So, first of all, we'll go to the Manchester United band issue now. So now you all know it's about is between the British billionaire Sajim Raffet and also the Qatari man. This is a serious one, as the two parties are all serious as they want to be the owners for Manchester United. Out all the fans wants the Glazers out of the club, and the Glazers have already announced this year they are going to sell the club, and you all know that all oh, that. Before send the first band and also the Glazers wants an improvement and they said the second band to the Glazers organization so and Manchester United is about to be sold and no one knows who's gonna take it and don't leave my competition guy do you think you want a uh, Jim Raffles or the Qatari man as this is the race to buy Manchester United from the Glazer family. And this is a serious one which will be the controversial for the fans as Sam Giraffles on the majority ownership with the company of the IOS and want a depth from there and also the vision is putting Manchester United putting Manchester back into Manchester United and is about to invest in the women's team. Why the Qatari man to at the Passage and Yarden 92 Foundation and the Jeffrey Manchester United is to be renowned for bowling exercise and to develop which are for the year these are the major grants about the two parties as they are going head to head in order to get the takeover from Manchester United as Manchester United is about to be sold to these two parties as recently Sajin Raffles was visit Ocha for to meet with Eric Tang and also the Manchester United Director Richard Allard and this was all someone from Saji Raffet. Just in a conversation, guys, do you think Saji Raffet should be the co the new owner of Manchester United or the Qatari man Al Tani? And this this is the plan for Old Trafford innovation for the Qatari Royal presented to the Glazers. The new Old Trafford will have its seat in the part of it and there will be 1,000 seats in total. This will be one of the modern and biggest stadiums in the world. Yeah, you that this is how Old Trafford will look like if the Qatari man attorney is the owner of Manchester United. Yeah, you that Old Trafford will be one of the latest and the biggest and also the fanciest stadium in Europe. And now we're going to go to back. Just tell me that conversation, guys. Who do you think should? Be the owner of Manchester United, is he Sajin Waflet or uh, Tani? Just do that conversation, guys. And secondly, we're going to go to Master Sabiza Permanent. Do you know Master Sabiza is actually doing awesome for under 10 for Manchester United? I'll be doing brilliantly well as Bayern Munich hope to be able to sell Master Sabiza for 20 million. Sabiza has made himself all stock thanks to his brilliance and awesome performance from Manchester United since his arrival you know the, the Austria player Marcel Sabiza has been awesomely doing well under Eric Tang from Manchester United just leave in the competition guys do you want Sabiza to be at this club permanently or should he go back to Bayern Munich as you have been awesome and doing awesomely well as Bayern Munich wants 20 million pounds in order to get now for Manchester United to get Marcel Sabiza just leave in the competition guys do you want the Oscar player who had been doing awesomely well for his international team and moving from Manchester United in creating chances and scoring goals and even assisting to stay at the club or to go back to Bayern Munich as his loan will expire in June as Bayern Munich won $20 million to take Master Sabiza as a Eric also wants Master Sabiza in his team for as Master Sabiza has been doing awesomely well as Casimo is suspended and my service is also leading away from Manchester United. Just me a conversation guys, do you want my service to stay at Manchester United permanently? Just me a conversation guys. Now we are going to go to the latest transfer news about Manchester United. I have been searching for some possible strikers in the summer window and there is plenty of opportunities as Manchester United wants a striker to replace Vout Vekos. I don't know Marshall can also be 
sell unknown to another club as we also have Victor Simon the 24 years from Nigeria as he's currently being in the form in Napoli and also Harry Kane the 30 years old the England player for Tottenham and even Goncalo Ramos the 21 years who is playing for Benfica and Ivan Tony the England who is playing for Brentford the 26 years old there are many and many players and strikers that can replace Vaz Bekos in the position and the main strikers are Victor Simon and Harry Kane Manchester United interest in Victor Simi as good because of his because of Napoli's 100 million price tag on the striker the club will need to, to sell a couple of players in order to be able to finance a move for the Nigerian superstar Victor Simi has been doing awesome work for Manchester for Napoli as he's currently in form and brilliant as Victor Simi is also an aggressive striker he has been doing awesome work at his scoring goals he has scored over 20 plus goals this season for Napoli has also doing well in the Champions League stage for his side for his Italian side at Napoli is actually leading awesome with Victor Simon doing awesome. The player loves the move so which for them his prestige to be able to play in one of the biggest clubs in the world. This transfer is about to be close to 100 million euros. Say you whether that the Simi price tag is over 100 million and Victor Simi is also needing work for Napoli and his price tag is 100 million. I didn't want Eritrea to get this this aggressive striker into the squad to boost the squad for more winning of games. Tell me in the comment section, guys. It is between Victor Simi and Harry Kane as Harry Kane is also doing well for Totti and Mino he has scored 20 plus goals but Victor Simi is also doing well for Napoli in the, in all stages and all competitions Victor Simi is awesome in the he is one of my favorite to take the striking spot for Manchester United and also Harry Kane is Manchester United priority transfer target this summer Eritrean wants an elite number 9 and the manager is driving to pursue the Tottenham striker Harry Kane. Harry Kane is also awesome leading well also and most most fans want Harry Kane over Victor Osimhen because he's, uh, he's from the Premier League and most fans also say Harry Kane is a rival to Manchester United so there shouldn't be no need to sign Harry Kane we should get Victor Osimhen there are different effects reactions towards this Eritrean has identified Harry Kane as his number one summer target for Manchester United. Yeah, you ready? Harry Kane who has got 20 plus goals for his 30 and side and they are also trophyless and they are also trophyless this season. You know Manchester United won the Carabao Cup but Harry Kane is trophyless but nevertheless Harry Kane is also a perfect match to stay at the Manchester United Harry Kane sport and to stay up front with Marcus Casper, Anthony and also various various players as Manchester United for the winning of games and various various awesome and important things for Manchester United. Love me a competition guys. Do you think it's supposed to be Vito Simi or I can leave in the comment section guys? And also Manchester United are interested in Frank De Jong. Frank De Jong has probably stated he wants to stay at Barcelona. So while wow, we have that in Frank De Jong wants to stay at Barcelona. So do you think it's also a good option for Manchester United to be to boost the midfield spot. You know, Marco Chesso has been doing awesomely well for Manchester United in scoring goals. He's one of the top scorers for Man United this season. Marco Chesso is awesomely doing well. And also, we also have Goncalo Ramos. He's a striker from Benfica. He's awesomely doing well. 24 years old. Victor Simi and Harry Kane. So these are the three main guys. The three main strikers for the striking spot at Manchester United. Even Dusan Vlavich, the Juventus star with Dusan Vlavich who have been scoring goals and creating chances for his squad is also leading way and he also among the priority and the transfer target for the striking spot for Manchester United. Manchester United also need a defender to replace uh, Maguire who is a shock 50 million sub summer target for PSG as I really put a D on the table for the defender in January. Manchester United need to are prepared to sell Maguire and Victor Linda Love this summer in order to get the space for a defender for to boost the squad for Manchester United in winning games and creating chances. Also, we also have the clean rights is Manchester United number one midfield target. The same as the perfect player for the approach next season. The West Ham will make it difficult for United. And this was according to a famous journalist Fabio Manu. So that's all for guys. We have talked about the bind and between Sajim Raflet and also the Qatari Bilonia. The uh, Tani. We have talked about that and also 
Marcel Sabiza, also permanent. Did you want Marcel Sabiza to stay in Manchester United? So just leave in the comment section, guys, of what you think of this awesome video, guys. Of what you think of the awesome topics, these three topics, and also we also have the transfer target. Is it between Victor Sime and also Harry Kane, Goncalo Ramos, and many more? As Manchester United awesomely need and seriously need a striker in the upfront for the attacking purpose. Thanks for watching the guys. Please do have the subscribe like and leave a comment below for cheating of the awesome video guys.